Thank you. Well, new footage shows what happened during a chase over the weekend. It was one of four police pursuits in Toledo. 13 Action News reporter Tony Gaptis live tonight with a look at what happened in your crime and safety alert. Tony? In two of those chases, Lee, someone died. Several others were taken to the hospital, and one woman is behind bars. This is how a pursuit out of Monroe County ended in the parking lot of Meyer off Alexis Road. It started after Monroe County deputies say they got a call about a vehicle driving erratically down I-75. It ended when the suspect's vehicle hit a deputy's cruiser and crashed into a pole in the parking lot. <coughs> Newly released dash and body cam from Toledo Police shows the arrest of the woman behind the wheel. This chase was one of four in the Glass City this weekend. The first happened late Friday on Oak Street on Toledo's east side. Toledo police tried to pull over the man behind the wheel. He sped away and crashed into a hardware store. Two young children were also in the car, along with a woman. They were all taken to the hospital. The driver died. And at about 2.30 Sunday morning, Toledo police were chasing an SUV when it crashed into a light pole at Oak and Milton. Officers took that driver into custody. Two passengers were treated for minor injuries. And at about 7.30 Sunday night, Toledo police say they were chasing a man and a woman who were suspects in a theft case. The vehicle they were inside crashed into a car at Monroe and Douglas, hit a woman at a gas station, then hit a pole. The crash killed the passenger, who's identified as Micah Hicks, who's 22 and from Detroit. The driver, 36-year-old Tyrone Hoy from Waukegan, Illinois, is charged with aggravated vehicular homicide. Why are you searching me? Because you're under arrest. So far, Toledo police have released footage from this pursuit where they assisted Monroe County and arrested Kizzy Williams, who's 43 and from West Bloomfield, Michigan. She's facing charges, including obstructing official business and receiving stolen property because this car she was driving was listed as stolen. Williams is set to face those charges in Toledo, plus additional charges in Michigan. We've requested footage from the pursuits from Ch Toledo police, and we will bring that to you to help shed some light on what may have happened in each of these instances as soon as it does become available. Lee?